friends. Here's a special for to you for you guys today. Um, one of the curiosities that I always had is is the older version Gary's uh, Aries version two gearbox compatible with uh, the Amoba new Amoba series line. Now, obviously, this is the Aries. This one's the Aries new uh, EFCS system. And looking at the the whole gearbox dimensionally, it really looks the same as for the gearbox. Uh, it looks the same as the older Aries uh, version version two. So one of the ideas I had was um, was building up an old Aries uh, version two gearbox with a twelve to one gear ratio and use it on my uh, CCP pistol. Now this one came out of my uh, Aries uh, AM008. It's the 10 inch model. But everyone knows if you look closely on the MOBA series line, all their lowers are really basically the same. So it doesn't matter if you get the pistol, the honey badger, the six inch or the 10 inch, the lowers are all pretty much the same. So what I'm going to try to do, like I said, is build up an older Ver uh, Aries version 2 gearbox so I could shoot a little bit quicker on my uh, CC CCP pistol because that one is shooting about, right now, for some reason, shooting around 19 and a half, 20 RPS. And as you know that the sector gears on these new uh, Aries uh, e EFCS systems is you really can't change out the gearing unless you can find a compatible sector gear for that magnet. So, like I said, what I'm going to try is build up this to a, a little run on, run on 12 to 1 gear ratios. Use the same batteries and motors and everything. But I suspect that I could make the older Aries run probably on, uh, how you say, uh, Probably closer to 23 RPS uh, using the old uh, old box under the CCP pistol. Like I said, um, it's just seen compatibly compatibility wise, it'll it'll work. But I'm pretty sure it will. Here's the MOBA series line, just the old Aries version two gearbox. Looks like you'll you'll definitely fit. I mean. I don't see why it would not fit. Dimensionally, it looks the same. I'm going to put in the pins and everything. And it looks like, oops, looks like it'll fit. Everything seems like it's lining up. God, the rear pin is always hard to push in. Might have to use my little hammer. Well, let's try it a little bit. So, yeah, the rears on a little bit on the on the mobile series are always a little bit tighter, but I could see everything is pretty much falling in place. So, let's try the hammer pin. I need a trigger pin. Looks like it'll fit too. So everything seems like it's going in. So definitely look like you can, from what I'm looking at, it really does look like you can use the older Aries uh, gearbox in the Omoba series. I could see that the trigger trigger housing could stick out here. Um, already put in the pins. I could see the magazine holes are lining up. So, looks like everything, looks like it'll work. It'll definitely work. Um, let's see if they'll fit the grip and the grip screws and everything. Oops, eh, one the pins fell out. So yeah, it looks like, let's see if uh, they'll screw in a little bit. So I'm screwing in the screws into the grip screws into the, the gearbox. Looks like it's going in fine. Uh, so 
I guess to answer that question, yes, you can use the older Aries gearbox on their MOBA series. And the only reason why you would really do that, like I said, is because you could run the higher speed gears with the older gear, uh, Aries box and get a little bit of faster rate of fire. So yeah, it looks like, definitely looks like it'll work. So on part two, what I'm gonna try to do is, like I said, I'm building up, I'll build up this uh, Aries uh, version two gearbox. So, so at least my CCP pistol will shoot about uh, an estimate 23 or maybe even 24 RPS with the new high speed gears. But like I said, I won't have uh, the e EFCS, so I'm gonna have to put in a MOSFET in those interesting micro switches from uh, Extreme Fire recommendations. So, uh, yeah, so we'll definitely give it a try on the next uh, video part and see if it works.